Today at the Alcona County Board of Commissioners meeting, the board discussed the insurance policies of county employees. Each year, the Board of Commissioners negotiates the insurance rates that the county pays for non-unionized county employees. The county's insurer, Cadillac Insurance, just submitted the new rates for these negotiations. The rates went up 1.96 percent, the smallest increase the board says they've seen in a few years. Chairman of the board, Kevin Boyd, says that last year and in years past, the board usually opts out, meaning that the county just pays for employee insurance. Now the board will meet with their insurance representative to look at some new policies, some that could require employees to pay a portion of their own insurance. The way things are, are and uh, a lot of it are, are to try to keep our sheriff's department running. Um, with the hunt millage failing, we, we lost $111,000 roughly. Uh, we lost the person and a half wages that we're going to try to make up. I mean, I guess it's, you look all over the country, over the world, it's people are have to pay a little bit for their insurance. And I'm not saying we should have to pay a million dollars, but maybe we should have to pay something. Some changes to the county's insurance policy that were mentioned today were having employees pay a hard cap that the state would decide or some percentage of their insurance. If the board does decide to make changes, it would take effect next year.